Hello and welcome to the channel. Here we have a really interesting puzzle which originated a few hundred years ago. Whilst the solution is simple to arrive at, it's the result that makes it interesting as it's so difficult to believe or comprehend. It makes for a really good interview question. Imagine that there's a rope wrapped tightly around the circumference of the earth. Now if we wanted to raise the height of the rope by 15 centimeters or 6 inches off the ground all the way around the circumference, how much extra length of rope is required? If you wish to give it a go, then please pause the video. As a clue, I will say that you do not need to know the dimensions of the Earth, but merely to assume it's a spherical object. Let's first approach the problem logically in order to derive a solution. We will then discuss a simpler, more intuitive explanation of why the solution is what it is. Here we have two concentric circles, the inner of which represents the circumference C1 of the Earth and the original rope that was wrapped tightly around it. The outer one represents the circumference C2 of the rope when raised 15 centimeters above the ground. The respective radii are R1 and R2 and the height raised is H. Now the difference in the radii R2 minus R1 is clearly the height H or 15 centimeters or 0.15 meters. The difference in the circumferences C2 minus C1 is clearly the extra length of rope required given by L. Now the circumference of a circle is given by the term 2 pi times r where pi has the value of approximately 3.14. Putting this in tells us that L is given by 2 pi times the difference in the radii which we already know is the height h. Thus L is equal to 2 pi times h or approximately 6.3 times h. Now as h is 0.15 meters we get a length of approximately 1 meter for the extra length of rope that will be required in order to encircle the Earth's circumference at a height of 15 centimeters above the ground instead of at ground level. Now this is a truly astounding result for a couple of reasons. Firstly, intuitively, the length just looks too small. And secondly, the derivation of the solution did not require any information on the dimensions of the object involved. Thus, this is a unique solution which is invariant to the size of an object and would apply to any spherical object from a football to a planet. But why is this so? And is there a simpler intuitive explanation? Well, let's have a go at doing this. We're going to look at two vastly different sized objects to gain some insight. The Earth and a football. Now, the radius of the Earth is approximately 6,400 kilometers or 6.4 million meters. As discussed earlier, its circumference is approximately 6.3 times its radius, which gives us a circumference of 40 million meters. Thus, in our puzzle, the original rope has these exact dimensions, as it is wrapped tightly around the Earth. The height increase of the rope is 15 centimeters, which is the same as the increase in the radius of the original rope. Now, the proportional change in radius is 0.15 divided by 6.4 million, or one part in 40 million. As the circumference is directly related to radius, its proportional increase is also 1 in 40 million. As the original circumference was 40 million meters, then that means the increase in circumference is approximately 1 meter. Now compare this to a string wrapped tightly around a football with a radius of 10 centimeters. Again, the circumference is 6.3 times the radius, or 63 centimeters. Now the height increase of the string is the same 15 centimeters as the Earth example, and this is the same as the increase in the radius of the original string. The proportional change is 15 over 10, which is 1.5 times, and this is the same as the proportional increase in the circumference. Thus the increase in circumference is 63 centimeters times 1.5, which is approximately 100 centimeters or 1 meter. Thus for any size circle, a radius increase of 15 centimetres results in an increase in circumference of approximately 1 metre. Another way of looking at it is that as the size of a circle increases, a 15 centimetre increase in radius becomes a smaller proportional increase. However, when this smaller proportional increase is applied to a larger value for the circumference, the resulting answer for the length remains constant. That wraps up the video, and thanks for watching. Please subscribe to view more like this, and I will see you in the next one.